a harpist that I get to work with on a regular basis named John Wiki. Um, if many, if any of you have been here in the past couple of years, he and I have played together here. And John is living in Atlanta, Georgia, and earlier this year he was asked by a, a girl who runs a public school music program there to write a piece for his middle school, for her, sorry, middle school harp ensemble. They'd been playing the harp for about a year, and they wanted to have something for their concert at the end of the year. So he wrote this piece called Under the Big Top. And it has five sections. What's your favorite? The snake charmer. Snake charmer? Clowns. Oh, the clowns? The bear. The bear, the dancing bear and the calliope? The acrobats. The acrobats. OK, so it's divided into sections. The first one is fanfare, I think. And then we have the elephants come in. The big elephants come in. Then we have the bear. old calliope and the dancing bear. Then the snake charmer. Snake charmer. Slithery, it says. <laughs> and then the the apple. And then the sparkly acrobats ascend in the sky, and then the clouds. Wow, the clouds. Ah, okay. So we're going to do the first performance of Under the Big Top outside of that middle school ensemble group that did it this spring. Um, a lot of the people who come here can do other things at very, very accomplished levels in addition to playing the harp. We have trombonists, we have pianists, we have dancers, we have singers, we have we have badminton players, we have, you know, mothers, we have all kinds of stuff going on here. And Emmanuel Rivera Angel, who is here, is also studying conducting. And so he's going to conduct as a chance to kind of get some experience conducting, and I'm going to join the group and play under the big top. Thanks for the heart. Esri is loaning me her heart for this.